It has been an active winter season for Southern California and today is no different with our next storm system moving into the Southland already bringing rain to parts of the Southland beginning to creep closer to the desert zooming in. You see some of those showers trying to work their way right around San Gregonio Mountain into the past, but the heaviest rain still much farther towards the west closer to Ontario at this time. But everything you're looking at is gradually working its way down towards the southeast and so some rain is expected here in the Coachella Valley really mainly through the seven eight o'clock hour is when I'm anticipating this, us to see the bulk of it. But when I say the bulk of it, it's still not a lot. It's very minimal accumulation this round for those of us here in the Coachella Valley. However, through the past for the mountains, still some nice amounts, especially when we're going to be talking about snow. This is another cold system. Those snow levels going to be dropping down to about 4,000 feet for the majority of San Bernardino and Riverside County mountains. Again, this is continuing through the rest of this evening. By uh, later tonight, say 10, 11 o'clock, we're really going to be watching everything around the Coachella Valley clear out, but for the mountains, still some light precipitation will be continuing into early tomorrow morning. Moving into our Tuesday, partly cloudy skies will be with us overhead. It's not going to last long though, because I'm tracking another storm system that is going to be arriving on Wednesday and even lingering with us into Thursday. So that is certainly going to be watched very closely by all of the first alert weather team. But for tonight, a winter storm warning for elevations above 5,500 feet and we're talking about multiple inches of snow uh, for some localized places even up to a foot but otherwise three to seven inches keep this in mind if you do have to head up the mountains the snow levels again dropping down to about 4,000 feet but the more notable accumulation staying above 5,000 plus for the valley as well as the high desert. We have wind alerts, a wind advisory for the high desert, a high wind warning for the Coachella Valley, including the San Gregonio Pass, where those gusts could get up to 65 miles per hour. So just be aware before you head out on the roads that there are going to be elements that you will be battling depending on where you're going. And I'm even expecting to see some of that wind linger with us into Tuesday. That's also why there's a windblown dust advisory in place due to the potential of air quality uh, becoming poor. Now on our Comfort Air 7 day forecast again, our next big weather event will be arriving Wednesday and Thursday. I'm calling for a first alert weather alert day for both of those days. But Peter, things are looking to clear out just in time for the new year. Oh, sounds good. All right. Thanks, Hank. <laughs> Your fill in was Kelly. Now I have to get used to saying you know, Haley I was again. only gone for a week, Peter. <laughs> it was only a week. <laughs> Haley, good to see you back. All right. Thanks so much.